Did you enjoy your stay? Yes. <laughs> so in, in this video, we are going to experience Korea's only six-star hotel, the world's best travel hotel ranked by CNN. So in this video, we want to give you guys a rundown from morning to night about what you can do in this hotel because honestly, it's called Paradise City, and in my opinion, it definitely is a city of paradise. Mm -hmm. So first, I want to give you guys a quick flashback of our first night at the hotel when we did a room service mukbang. Yay! We're finally, finally eating! Eat after 30 minutes of zero! Yeah! So, my $30 cheeseburger over here. And Let's see if it's gonna taste that way. Mmm! Wow! That meat is good. So, something that maybe you guys didn't know is that Blackpink is actually the brand ambassador of this hotel. So, they are literally plastered everywhere on all the posters and everywhere in the hotel. So, in this video, we want to actually show not only about the hotel room uh, and the facilities, but also we want to take you guys inside the sauna, which is called the Summer, and also inside Wonderbox, which is an indoor theme park, which actually is also my favorite theme park now. I was surprised that you really like it though. Well, because all the rides, I don't like rides, and those rides were more safe for me, um, but I really like you the- You mean the kitty ride? Yeah. <laughs> No, but I really like the I really like the carnival games. I'm I like I love those carnival games. So I hope you guys can enjoy a 24 hours at this hotel tour. Uh, and please enjoy the video. Good morning. Good morning. Right now we are in Paradise City, um, which is literally like a city. It's actually a city full of paradise. I know it is. Everything you can do everything here. Um, and as you guys can see, you can also have a cinnamon latte. Cinnamon cinnamon latte. Good job. Get? Good job. Cafe latte? Ice cafe latte as usual and a bread croissant. Today what we're going to do after we drink our coffee to get energized is actually we're going to go to Simmer. Yes. Right? Simmer. C-I-M-E-R which is the sauna um, which is not technically part of the hotel. Yes. It's part of the Paradise City kind of uh, area mm -hmm. I guess but not uh, part of the So you don't get access. The additional cost you have to pay um, but you do get 30% off, right? Yes, if you are staying at Paradise Hotel City Guest. Hotel. So definitely check that out. Um, we typically go to the Simmer when we're not even staying at this hotel. Right. When we want to go to like the best sauna in Korea, hands down, I give it to Simmer so far. Don't Clean you think? Is the best. And it, it, it is, it's a little bit pricey. Um, it's not it's not the most cheap sauna you can find, but I, in my opinion, definitely worth it because if you want to go to sauna, it's all about relaxation um, and lesser people. So, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Though definitely a lot less people, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So yeah, we'll see you guys at the simmer, and after that, we're gonna go to Wonderbox and go on some ride, possibly. Wait, isn't um, Wonderbox famous for a filming uh, location? Yeah, so it's in Hotel Drama? Deluna. Oh yeah, it's Hotel Deluna. Anyways, we'll see you guys at the simmer, all dressed in our sauna clothes. See you guys there. Simmer, here we go. Let's go. Sauna time. <laughs> What are you wearing though? Um, this is apparently for the woman, uh, for their sauna. Bam! Bam! Oh, you look good, mister. It's the man outfit of the day. Oh my god, okay, okay, stop, 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 stop. 
All right, so we just entered the spa, Simmer Spa. Yeah. There's also a spa in the hotel, but um, we decided to come here because it's public. No, that's wrong. We're, it's it's co-ed because we're fully clothed. The one in the hotel, you get naked, so female and male are separated. So yeah, that's why we decided to come here so we can actually spend time together. There's also a restaurant, a fitness room. Uh, there's a healing place, relaxation places, and nails. There's also a place for facials and massages for all the girls to get their their skin treated. And there's a really nice swimming pool inside in the middle. However, that's an extra fee, right? That's an added fee, so make sure you take that into account. I think the total cost for everything, all the services here is $50. Yeah. Um, it doesn't include the massage and facials, those are in, uh, added costs, obviously, but all the facilities here that you can actually enter without having to uh, make a reservation for uh, is including $50. But uh, yeah, we are going to enjoy ourselves. It's also an outside section, oh, yeah. which is which is actually really nice when the temperature is good. So I think we'll take you guys out there too. Um, but yeah, we're gonna enjoy ourselves at this spa because I absolutely love saunas. <laughs> Sauna man. <laughs> Alright, so we just entered the salt room. It's 67 degrees Celsius and I found a potato. <laughs> Hi, potato. It's nice, no? Yeah, I don't want to move. The 67 degrees is like perfect for her. The one I like is 87 degrees oh, yeah, though. I'm not going there. Bye-bye. <laughs> so typically Sunny doesn't do well with saunas. She gets really hot really quickly, unfortunately, because I love them. But anyway, so she went to the one that was salt room, 67 degrees. I'm gonna go to Bolgama, which is eight, uh, 86 or 87 degrees. It keeps on shifting, so I'm gonna go there now. Bye. 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 86 degrees. Wow, it's pitch dark. I can't see anything. It's so dark in here. Holy smokes, you only see the lights. Guys, the one thing about sauna is that nothing is better than. Shit. If you guys don't know, it's basically uh, rice with sugar. Mm and one other ingredient, I forget what it was, but it's absolutely amazing. Typically in Los Angeles, uh, you can actually get this in small doses after you eat at a Korean restaurant. Yeah. Um, but here, a jumbo size. It's actually my favorite drink in all of Korea. And basically Sunny was telling me that it's part of a Korean sauna culture. Mm -hmm. So after you, drink, after, after you drink the sauna, after you go into the sauna, you get the shike. Um, I guess similar to like in Japan, after you go to the hot spring, everyone gets a glass bottle of milk. Um, or milk coffee is kind of the thing we do, but you guys do shike. Honestly, I like the shike more. So to me, the little rice acts as like little boba, little tapioca, and the drink itself is just like a really sweetened water. Mm, like so literally good. perfect after you're like drenched in sweat from the mm. sun, right? So we're now outside. As you can see, it's absolutely gorgeous at nighttime. I think it's one of our first times at night. The lights light up really nicely, don't they? Yeah. Okay, so in order to actually, this is, a, this is like a foot bath here, and then you can sit all around there. But in order to get here, this part is made out of all these little rocks, as you guys can see. I can't deal with it. I cannot walk with it, but Sunny can do it. I don't know how you can walk on that many rocks. You can, you can hop too? Wait, doesn't hurt you at all? Really? My blood circulation is really good. Minus two. Uh, we'll see. Chris, it's your turn. Honestly, whenever I do this, I always walk on the on the benches. <laughs> but, but today, video, I'll see if I can do it. I, I can never do it though. Come on, walk. Wait, wait. Walk. <laughs> I don't know how you can be jumping. Your parents are watching this, Chris. <laughs> don't let them down, Chris. It's okay, only, only, walk. only my mom and my family can do this. <laughs> So we have a Bulgama, 80 degrees Celsius outside. Sunny's favorite, right? Yeah, it's your favorite. Let's go. Oh my gosh. Oh, hot. And I love, I love the feeling. I don't know why, but the feeling of just sweating in absolute heat makes me feel really nice. I think it's I think something it's that. No, I was about to say, I think it's only, actually, I was about to say, I think it's only certain people. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, so 
are you are you ready to head to our next activity at this hotel? Yeah. Yeah. You seem so relaxed. Okay. Bye. 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 Oh my god, that was good. The best. I had to put on makeup again. Sunny always basically mentions that I am so much more Korean than she is because I love the sauna. <laughs> That's true. Anyway, so we just finished Simmer and Wonderbox is actually right next door. So yeah. we're gonna head to Wonderbox right now. Let's head to the amusement park. <laughs> play the games here you guys need to buy a special card so there's a car carnival ca uh, game ticket uh, or, like every corner so make sure you guys get it in order to be able to play and I got for six games 11,000 Korean won <laughs> All right, guys. This is a classic game. You literally have to shoot the water at the at the target, and then whoever hits it more, the thing will go to fly up. Oh! Let's go! Let's go! Congratulations, player number three. Oh, but I won, but you didn't shoot. <laughs> hey, even the Chris win, but I got it. Do this ride. Hey, come with me. No, 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 no. No. I'm scared of this one too. Milk ice cream with look at this cone. It's got sprinkles. It looks like maybe some strawberry frosting and some fruit loops on the side. Amazing. Oh my god. So I can do my own move slow. I don't need a hint to hold. Are you ready for bump for cars? Yeah. Alright, I'm ready. Let's go, let's go. I'm gonna give you eyes. Oh shoot! Here we go! Here we go! Now she wants to do happy swing. Sunny. I don't know why Sunny likes this stuff so much. I hate it. Let's go. Lunchtime. So I got a chili dog, she got some french fries, chili cheese fries, and we both got some churros to share. Can't wait. Sunny. Yeah. I need this food after going on those rides. My stomach feels really bad right now. These kid rides are killing me. Oh, it's tiny. Mr. Chris loves mini Ferris wheel. Okay guys, we're on a Ferris wheel, a mini Ferris wheel, and we had a lot of fun. So we're gonna explore more of the hotel, and we'll see you guys later. By far my favorite theme park in the whole world. Double thumbs up. Yay. Oh, yo, yo, yo. All right, so we just finished some of the B-roll, and now Sonny wants to take a sleep before dinner time. She's right there. You can't sleep for too long though, because we have a dinner reservation in two hours. Oh my God, it's in two hours, Chris. He said I can take a nap for 10 minutes. No, do you know why? Let's take a nap for 10 minutes. Do you know why? Because when Sunny takes a nap, she says for one hour, but it lasts for like four hours. <laughs> <laughs> it's true, man. No, it's no, true. No, don't lie, it's two hours. Okay, well, let's, okay, let's stop talking so you can start your nap now. Okay. Okay, good night. Bye. Bye, bye, bye. Alright, so she just woke up from her nap and we're now we're headed to dinner. 
Yay. Yay, yay, yay. Also, Paradise City actually has a lot of selections for restaurants. Uh, downstairs, from what I can tell, they had four restaurants, an Italian, uh, Japanese, Chinese, and I guess a buffet style. There's also like a cheaper option within the, like the city area before you enter the hotel. Um, and there's actually like restaurants all around this place, isn't there? Mm -hmm. So if you guys want a cheaper option, if you guys want a nicer option, if you guys want room service, we did that too. I mean, there's plenty of food options at this hotel. So we chose to reserve the, um, I think it's called Imperial Chinese something. something. Imperial Chinese House, I think it's called. I think it's fine Chinese cuisine or something. It's, it, yeah, yeah, it's fine Chinese cuisine. And yeah, we decided that just because honestly, the entrance looked really cool. Yeah. And I can always use some, some Chinese food. I love my Chinese food. So mm. anyways, let's go. Let's go. Guys, we just made it to the Chinese restaurant, and uh, we didn't really realize, but all the dishes are really expensive. <laughs> so the dim sum, we just had the dim sum, but they also have like fried shark tails, and that's all this like weird, crazy Chinese food that I've never had in my life. But it was ranging from like average, I would say, what 60, 70 dollars for one dish. They have a lot of course menus. Um, I saw the course, one of the course menus was as much as like 250 dollars uh, per person. So. Yeah, if you guys want fine dining, then you can find it here. We, we just got a lot of dim sum. Uh, we got a lot of expensive dumplings, I would say. It looks like $20 for three dumplings. That's like $7 a dumpling. But you know what? I love Paradise City, so it's okay. I will pay $7 for a dumpling. Are you eating my food? Yep. Well, I'm busy filming, you're just eating my food? Mm. So, Sunny, was it worth it? Oh my god, yeah. This restaurant, honestly, I would say was definitely worth the price. $7 per dumpling was definitely worth it. So anyways, we are going to end the vlog here uh, and then head back upstairs and call it a night. Good night. All right guys, so now we are in a cab. Uh, so unlike most people who are leaving the hotel, we are heading back home. We're not going to the airport, Yay! despite it being right next to Incheon Airport, which is why you're supposed to stay at this hotel in the first place, I think. <laughs> um, but yeah, I enjoyed this hotel a lot. It is definitely my favorite hotel in the world, I think. Mine too. Um, so yeah, if you guys are interested in coming to Korea, uh, flying into Incheon Airport, I would highly recommend staying at this hotel. I mean, it was ranked the world's best travel airport in the world, so uh, that is something to consider. Uh, has everything I need, sauna, uh, an indoor theme park that I absolutely love, great food, nice restaurants, great facilities, right. and it was an amazing experience. So yeah, if you guys want to learn more about the hotel, we'll leave links in the description down below. Uh, please check out Sunny Dahe and Sunny Dahe Inn. And please like, comment, share, and subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.